Once you've installed Connect and you've launched the application, you'll see a sign-in screen similar to this. Before you actually get signed in, you may need to configure this to your Filebound website. To do so, click on the Configure button below your Sign-in button. From here, you'll see a Site section, and you'll be able to enter the URL for your Filebound site. You can test this by clicking the Test button, which will verify that this is a valid URL. It looks like this one is valid, so I'm going to go ahead and click OK. And then I'm going to enter my Filebound credentials, which will be the same as I would use on my Filebound website. Once I've done so, I can click Sign In, and I'm taken to the interface. Now, your screen might be blank like this if you have yet to get into any projects using Connect. You'll see here at the top that we have our Project Type drop-down menu and our Project menu. I'm going to go ahead and select an HR project type, and from here, I'm going to select my HR employees project. Now, that project type dropdown may not be available to you depending on your administrative settings. Now here, you'll see you have your separators listed as tabs up at the top, and then your dividers will be listed below this. Underneath, you'll have your index fields, which are going to be searchable fields. Up towards the top, you'll have your scan and import buttons, which will not be activated until you choose to actually create a file. You also have your search, your indexing queue, your assignments, and your recycle bin. Your indexing queue, when selected, will actually take you to a separate window outside of the application, which you can use to index your documents similarly to how you would in the Filebound interface. Your assignments will take you directly to the Filebound website that you've configured your Connect application with. Now up at the top, you'll have your settings, your help options, and your integration options. If you click on settings, you'll have your general alert and import options, as well as your integration options. In addition to this, you have the ability to sign out or exit. In your help menu, you have the ability to go directly to the Filebound help site by clicking online help. This will open up in your web browser and you'll be able to search for any number of help topics or use the drop-down menus at the top of your screen. And here you have your integration setup menu. We will be going over this in a separate video, but from here you can actually manage your existing integrations. Down towards the bottom of the interface, you have this scrolling transparency bar. This is great for if you're working within a separate application and you need to be using both Connect and be able to view other items on your screen simultaneously. This can be adjusted to any level of opaqueness. And then if you are using integrations down towards the bottom, you may need to ensure that your integration mode is selected as on.